there daydreamers and welcome back to the daydreamers channel as you probably guessed by the title it's what I got in Paris haul so I have a few things beside me and the first thing that I got in Paris was this apron as you probably would have seen in my video with my best friend that I shot with recently it's um, my one of my favorites is baking and I thought I would pick up this apron and wear it while I'm baking cupcakes so as soon as I saw this I was like yes this is perfect look at that how pretty is this it's literally in baby pink it's so nice everything's Parisian the Eiffel Tower's on there I just think this is beautiful and have a look at this bow oh my goodness the polka dots on there I absolutely love it I cannot wait to wear it Arc de Triomphe that's what it says there and Paris up the front and got macaroons as well so yeah I am so thrilled about this apron there was other styled aprons there but I was like yep I was withdrawn not withdrawn I was drawn to it so yeah I cannot wait to wear this oh, how beautiful is this I absolutely love it absolutely love it okay next thing that I bought and I had to buy this I just could not leave the shop without it is my very own cooling mat and glove it is matching my apron look at it like if you was to go somewhere and buy something and then you saw something that matched that item that you bought come on guys surely you would buy it too I know you would I know you would so I went ahead and I bought it so the gl one glove and the cooling mat and I said to her like is it not gonna burn the material she was like no 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 you can just take it out and take the cupcakes off or take the cake or whatever it is that you've baked and put it on here to cool down I was like oh okay well that would make sense you know you know logic so yeah my glove my favorite on gloves and a cooling mat I cannot wait to use these together okay you can stop now so I'm up in Montparnasse Tower now doing the 360 tour and it starts to you know how it is when the sun sets there even though there was no sun and you're sitting at the table with your other half drinking champagne to celebrate your four-year anniversary if you ever did that and he then decides to bring out that one true love that you first saw as you walked into the shop <sighs> you guys he got it for me when I saw it I was like are you joking are you actually joking you bought it for me how pretty is this now it may not be much but it was much to me at the time it meant much to me at the time and it still does but I didn't expect him to to buy it um so he yeah he bought it for me as an anniversary gift and I really appreciate it and what I'm gonna do with it is most probably put my makeup brushes in there you know the real techniques you know shout out to the pixie woos babes and maybe a few bits and bobs of makeup like blushes and mascara etc or maybe just shove in there a bit of hairpins or some of my lush products you know and take with me on my journey to work in my fighting animal testing bag that's just sitting over there <laughs> yeah next thing that I got was scarves so the reason why I'm wearing it in this video is to um, 
not only show you guys that is one of the things that I bought but because I'm wearing black and I just thought black my favorite color is gold so why not so I bought this black and gold scarf brown and gold scarf and did you get it did you guess it no did you say gold as well well you're in fact actually wrong because it's black and pink so I really like these type of scarves and I thought let's just buy it just wear it whenever I want to wrap my hair or when I go to work this is what I do I'll put it up in my hair and I'll tie it at the front and I'll just rock it at work so at work we sell knot wraps and if you know about knot wraps knot wraps um, are when you not wrap a gift and you pass it on to somebody and then they can return that kind just a favor to somebody else or they can keep it and maybe use it as a headgear that's what I do with these scarves I like to use it as headgear and wear it to work and then tie it at the front and I really really enjoyed not enjoyed and I really really loved the, these colors and I was like I have to get these so I think it was five for three euros so not only did I get the gold and black pink and black brown and black I also got grey and black and I also got another one and I can't remember I can't remember what the other colour was because I've already given that to somebody as a gift but um yeah so it was five for three euros next thing that i bought which wasn't in paris but it's along the baking theme is i bought some measuring cups because you know a baker can't bake without measuring cups i mean they can but this baker ain't because I like to follow instructions, you know. Yeah, that's me. But um, my baking cups. So we have an egg separator. Oh my goodness, how handy is that? Egg separator. Quarter cup, third of a cup, half a cup, three quarters of a cup, one cup and you know when you want to level up the flour and you need to like leveled i've got my leveler yeah leveler so it's called leveler just level away <laughs> i don't know why i'm acting so weird today i know that I have measuring cups and if I wanted to I could just use the measuring cups as measuring spoons but there's no point so I got myself some measuring spoons so in the measuring spoons it's the same as the measuring cups in the in terms of measurement quarter teaspoon half a teaspoon one teaspoon half a tablespoon and one tablespoon and I really, really love how these are in colours. These are coloured because it's like it's easier to spot when you're in the when they're in the drawer, and you can just pop it out, take it out, use it, do what you gotta do. Put your tablespoons in and your teaspoons in, and then just bang it back in. And I like how it's connected to a ring, so they're all joined together. I think it's very handy and I thought let me not take it back because I know me and one day I'm gonna need tablespoons and teaspoons so I decided to keep them and these I apologize for the noise by the way as well and these are from John Lewis so That is everything that I bought in Paris. Thanks for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Leave your comments in the box below of what videos I can film next. And tell me what one thing you like to bake. 
and I will reply to you guys and I will see you in my next video. Thanks for watching again. Bye!